Hey guys, FeebDem here, back with episode 9 of my 10k Scott Builder series, series, and I'd like to apologise for missing yesterday's upload, I was very busy and I just, it was too late by the time I wanted to start recording, so I decided I'd leave it, and hopefully I can have two videos up tomorrow or the day after, just to make up for it. But, um, starting this off on goals today, we have David De Gea, uh, he's 6 foot 4, cost me 650 coins, he's got great stats in him, 84 reflexes, 85 kicking, 82 handling, 80 diving on an 80 keeper, uh, is very very good. He made a lot of great saves. He fumbled the ball a bit, but um never didn't give away many sloppy goals and was just a great keeper to have for six hundred and fifty coins. Now right back we have Mendy, uh, who plays for Liverpool with seventy eight pace, uh sixty three dribbling, sixty one defending, and he was actually a really really fun player. He got up and he got up and down the pitch. He made a lot of great runs, made a lot of great passes, made a lot of great tackles. He was just a really really fun player to have. Um I really liked him because he was only bronze and he played really really well. Um, and he cost me 550 coins and he was well worth it. Now beside him we have my favourite centre back which is McQuell, who is only a 62 rate of bronze with 72 pace, 70 defending, 75 heading. Those are crazy stats on a, on a bronze player. Uh, he plays for Arsenal, he cost me 450 coins. He's 6 foot 4 so he's very very tall, he's very very fast, he's very very strong, wins a lot of headers with that high heading stat. He was actually an, an absolute beast of a defender. Uh, I don't see how he's not a silver rated card because he's actually He's such a class player to play with. Uh, well, well worth the money. Um, definitely, definitely my favorite centre back I've used in a while, even though he's bronze. Um, beside him we have Marcano, with seventy pace, seventy seven defending, seventy five heading. Another very, very solid centre back. Um, he is pretty much the same stats as uh, Miquel, just a bit better in defending, and you just see the difference. He's up eleven, um, eleven rating from. He cost me one thousand three hundred coins. He's six foot two, wins a lot of headers. Um, this is a very very solid quick centre backs we had, and um, I conceded very little goals with this team. Uh, left back we have Bermudo with eighty pace, uh, sixty defending, sixty heading. He was just a, he only cost me two hundred coins. He was just a bargain. I just I just picked him up uh, as he was quick left back, and he was nice and cheap. Uh, but he did the job. Very good, very very good left back. Um, I really enjoyed playing with him. Now at right centre mid we have Jordi Gomez with seventy pace, seventy shooting, seventy two passing. 75 dribbling, those are great stats on a silver player. Uh, we actually have four players who play in the Barclays Premier League. Five, sorry, and they're all linked up together. Um, and they actually did really well. Playing up the right side was quite strong. Um, a lot of the runs were down the left side, but a lot of the build-up play was on the right. Um, he actually had great stats on him, scored a few good goals. He's a nice shot in him. has really nice control, has really nice, really nice pass in him. Highly recommend him. He only cost me 750 coins and he was a great player. Now beside him in the centre, in the very centre of midfield, we have Mikel Arteta with 66 pace, which is a bit slow, but he still he still gets around the place. He's not that slow. With 81 shooting, which is great. He is in very, very nice shot in him. 85 passing. He was giving amazing through balls up to the wingers and the forwards. And they really, really abused defence. They absolutely tore defences apart with his great passing and their pace. Um... But he cost me 1,500 coins. He has a great free kick set on him. He's got very, very close control with 84 dribbling. He was a really fun player to walk the ball with and give nice true passes. He could hold it up and he could give it off. He was a great player to have in centre midfield for 1,500 coins. Now, beside him, we have Iquo, 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 Iquo something like that, Falque, <laughs> uh, with 79 pace. He's quite quick, Um, 70 passing, 81 dribbling, very, very nice close control on him. And he was giving a lot of great passes up as well. Um, it was a really really fun set to me to be playing with. They had a lot of, they were quite quick actually. Um, they weren't being caught out for pace a lot, and uh, made a lot of great passes and were very very attacking. Um, he cost me one thousand one hundred coins. He was very very good. Um, I highly recommend him. And now right, right wing we have Reyes with eighty eight pace, seventy nine shooting, seventy eight passing, eighty seven dribbling. He has got crazy close control and four star skills. Uh, he's got an absolute rocket of a left foot on him. Uh, he was a very very good player. Only cost me eight hundred coins. For an 85 rated right wing with that much pace and a great shot in him. Um, I highly recommend him if you're going off and building a Spanish team. Uh, now at left wing we have La Fuente with 90 pace. 67 dribbling. Uh, it doesn't look like he's a good shot in him but he's a very very good finesse on him. Um, scores a, He actually scored a lot of great goals. He was constantly bombing it down the left wing. Um, given a, he got a lot of through balls. Crossed him in or cut inside himself. He scored a lot of goals for me actually. Um... A very very good player. His stats don't really reflect his card. Uh, he's actually a really really fun player to play with. He's very very quick. Uh, scored a lot of good goals for me, and I was actually uh very very surprised. He only cost me four hundred coins, 
and uh, he was well worth the money. He was a great player. Now up front we have the main man Christian Tello. He only looks like a bronze, but he's just like Kaneki. Um, he is very very quick with 87 pace. That shooting stat 58 is is an absolute lie. He scored 10 goals in six games for me, and um, people rage quit four games against me out of six, which just shows how much of a beast team this was. These guys were very 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 good. 65 dribbling. He actually had very very close control. He worked his way through a lot of defenders. 87 pace. He made the amount of incredible runs he made. Where he's all he was always looking for the ball. He was such an attacking player. Every time he gave a through ball, he was always there chasing it down, trying to win it. And a lot of the times he did win it. Um, he was my favorite forward to play with. I picked him up for 450 coins, which is an absolute bargain on him. Um, he's not in striker. He costs a lot more if you're gonna buy him in striker, but I highly recommend him. He is an absolute beast of a player. Um, I was go I was thinking of getting a goal striker, but Christian Tello just. Oh, he was just an amazing player to play with, and I, I definitely recommend getting him if you've never tried him before. He's probably my favourite bronze striker I've ever played with. But yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the episode. Hopefully I'll have two up um, either tomorrow or the day after. But yeah, uh, please leave a like, please comment, and please subscribe if you're new to the channel. Okay, bye. <laughs>